Hey guys, welcome to Macintosh Weekly, and today this video is about the Mac OS 26.2 Beta 3 update. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe, and now let's begin. Apple today provided the third beta of an upcoming Mac OS Tahoe 26.2 update to developers for testing purposes, with the update coming a week after Apple released the second beta. To update to the Mac OS 20.2 Beta 3, open System Settings, then go to the Software Updates section, and then check for updates. Here you can see the update is available for my device. The Mac OS 26.2 Beta 2 update size is around 3.04 GB for my device. Click on Update Now, and then agree to the SLA to begin the update on your device and enter the password when prompted. And you can see, the device has been successfully updated to macOS Tahoe 26.2 Beta 3, and the build number is 25C5048A. Moving forward and talking about the changes and improvements made in this build. This beta focuses primarily on bug fixes, performance refinements, and minor developer tools rather than major new features, signaling that the update is stabilizing for a potential public release in mid-December 2025. Talking about macOS Tahoe 26.2 Beta 3 release notes. The macOS 26.2 SDK provides support to develop apps for Mac computers running Tahoe 26.2 Beta 3. The SDK comes bundled with Xcode 26.2, available from the Mac App Store. Based on release notes and early tester feedback, there are several bug fixes. Time machine backups to NAS, network attached storage, devices are working again for many users, resolving a regression from earlier betas. Preview app highlighting issues have been addressed. Mail app folder moving problems, where drag and drop or commands failed, appear resolved. For developer tools, new StoreKit API updates for easier in-app purchase testing and instruments app enhancements for profiling. No major new features. This aligns with the lighter scope of point releases, emphasizing stability over additions like those in the base Tahoe 15 launch, example liquid glass UI redesign, extended Intel support ending for most models. Talking about issues in this build. Regarding Safari crashes, closing tabs via the X button, but not Command W, can cause instant crashes. Regarding animations in UI, choppy scrolling in apps like Word or Microsoft Office, oversized shadows on volume brightness HUDs, especially in full screen video. A third party tool can revert to pre Tahoe HUD styles if needed. Regarding performance, occasional freezing or lag on M3 M4 Max during heavy tasks, some users report smoother experience than Beta 2. Regarding battery, no widespread battery drain reported yet, but monitor for your workflow. The rest of the build seems identical to the previous betas. So that was it, hope it was useful, consider like for the video, subscribe to the channel, and if you have any questions, just comment down below. Thanks for watching, and have a great day ahead.